Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Farmer Girl Jess and I'm back again with another video. Today I'm cooking for you some fish. You understand? I go and do it seared pan, pan seared. You understand? And the kitty apart. You understand? So we're gonna get into this. We're gonna get into this. Let's go. Let's go. Tell him where well, it now look like <laughs> Friday night. Friday night funs. <laughs> we there cooking. <laughs> yeah. I get old. No more fun. Pretty. Yeah. Ready for the go. Ready to go. <laughs> so your mother anything. I guess it's cut her, eh? No. <laughs> <laughs> Millions, I say yes. You yes. ever come to the farm? No. Every day I'm saying come and join my farm. <laughs> Something always happens, you know? Well, I don't have too much animal. Mm -mm -mm. Rosemary potatoes, all right. The restaurant have nothing on this. And you want to go somewhere? Oh, waste the money. Yeah. This is some good stuff. Stopping right from the ear. Gray be like, yeah man, leave the pigeons with me. Thank you. Excuse me. Yeah. So this is what I got from the farm. I got some beautiful rabbits. Look at this one. I get some nice rabbits to work with. Oh yeah. This is looking really good. How much potatoes do you? I know. I'm very hungry, I guess. Yes. I'm running around. One whole day and don't buy nothing. Can you imagine? Nothing about. Yummy. This looks really good. Thanks, Uliana. <laughs> Yeah. 
Hey, what's he doing in there? Stop biting me. Shh. Out. Come out. It's a funny stone road at the moment, you see it? Intersection of a Walterman Spanish stone road. Flood out, you know? You have to understand it, cross it, you see me? Yeah, you follow on the turn on the lane now, and you ask me. Watch where I go on the lane now. Now the look for public swear. One word, watch where I go on. You see there? All of the place, river bed, you see me? They all got it. Look what my business place look like. Huh? Hmm? Look here. Look on the narrow road. Huh? This is Mo Bay. Currently there is no heavy rain, just light drizzling. As you can see, the sky is overcast. But apart from that, people on the road and there's no heavy rain or wind at the moment. guys what's up it's your girl farmer girl Jess and guess what I'll be doing today I'll be cooking some fish so welcome to my channel okay guys so basically I'm at my friend's house and she's gone left me on the road and i'm gone on the road you know so basically i'm 
going to do some garlic. Cut them up for you. You understand? Cut up garlic. I love garlic. With my camera equipment. You understand? I really need to set up like a car because I'm going to be carrying like a lot of stuff. But anyway, this is how I started anyway. So I can do a good thing, you know? Catch up the phone one little way and thing. So, all right, I'm going to get three cloves of garlic on this. Alright, three cloves of garlic. Three cloves of niceness. Alright, put that all there like so. Alright, so I cut up. Scallion. Garlic and scallion. Don't need not more than that. You must learn. All them other ingredients that people use is overrated. So I have my garlic, scotchy bunny pepper I'm going to try and find now, or I can use these red peppers, yes, red peppers. I'm put some red pepper and the sun. What does this look like to you guys? This look like hot sauce. This look like some wicked hot sauce. Let me smell it. This is sesame seed oil. I don't want that. Because that's to make hummus. And they have homemade hummus in the fridge. Oh, the lighting is really bad. Sorry, you guys. They have homemade hummus in the fridge. Alright. I'm going to take two of these filly. Massa fillets and you know do it nice but do it nice all right so i have my fish fillet them and my red pepper all right so i'm gonna mix up everybody together so, i'll just scrape this in the plate Chili 
les très fort. fishes into slices like cut them in half like divide them evenly yes I know the ice is still in there but can start attacking them both. I cut them. And that's one. Yeah. I'm gonna add a little black pepper to it. And salt. Everybody know what salt look like, but I don't see any salt in the house okay hmm we'll find the salt later so this is what it's looking like now put on the fire to hot the oil okay the salt I have a pinch of salt. As you know, we burn the garlic and the seasoning in everything. I should have washed off the fish, but you know, when you kind of feel hungry and you forget to. Oh, yes, you need to do that. Yeah. Anyway. for like for two minutes then we're back over here now turn them around make sure them evenly have the seasoning on it like i said these are going to be pan smeared these are going to be pan smeared so I don't know. gonna curry these fish I swear anyway after I leave my tripod and thing I feel with the back camera and do this but such is life you know it's gonna be so nice Ah. The, the 
lighting the bad lighting is irritating me you guys so I have the curry powder that's our curry tender curry powder You can put the curry powder in like this now and make the curry powder burn out in the oil with the fish. You get me? Just gonna let that burn and give the, the fish a nice little color, you know. I'm gonna have to turn it. Okay. Turn up the stove a little bit more. And just let that one cook. You see the, the juices from the fish start to flow now because the ice starting to melt in the fish. So, yeah. the fish and get the color you know yeah guys Simmer. All right, I add some potatoes in there to make it simmer down with it. I like the potatoes with the skin on it, so yeah. So see, guys, I let this fish on top of the potatoes, and I'm going to make that simmer down now and cook. I'm going to add more black pepper. I love my black pepper. Add a little bit more, Wait. and it smells really good, you guys. This curry powder, I'm not used to it, it's like a red looking curry powder. All right, guys, see it coming along here, and it's simmering down, and everything, and it's coming together, you know. Turn up the stove really high so it can cook fast, and just monitor it. This looks amazing. It tastes good too. I just taste it. Mm. Yo, you guys, it's a long time I don't see this like red looking curry and I like in the color that it's giving the fish. It don't look like fish, it looks like chicken, right? Mm -hmm. It's really good. So, so I'm gonna cover him up now. Yeah, that's on. Make him simmer down for another five minutes and it's ready. Okay guys, so okay guys, so it is finished now and ready to be served. I don't like rice, so I'm just gonna eat the potatoes with the fish just like this. Yeah. Okay guys, this is what we're looking at. Cooking with Miss Jess. The meat is nice fish it's so good so refreshing
this is it. This is the finished result. The potatoes are cooked also. And it's really good. It's amazing you guys, so mm. Thanks for watching Remember to like, subscribe and share To my YouTube channel um, You know, I really love and appreciate all of you guys So just remember to like, share and subscribe my videos so when you like the video it helps the channel yeah basically this is this is amazing this is spicy and I like the curry it's not heavy and it's not too yellow in a sprite mm -hmm. it tastes good Mmm. back here. You want to try it? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. 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 What are you doing? Okay. 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 What's up, guys? I'm going live right now on YouTube. Yeah. Thank God for wine, right?